Hello and welcome to Provis Gaming. I am pleased to bring you a new series. We are playing Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor. I know this game did release a while back, but uh, it was a little bit too expensive. And I was like, I can't really justify that price point. Less than a week ago, though, there was a daily deal for Shadow of Mordor. I got like 10 or 15 bucks off and I said, okay, fine. Now I'll buy it. So I got Shadow of Mordor for the PC. Now for this playthrough, I will be using the Xbox controller plugged into my PC because I tend to prefer that experience. But otherwise, yeah, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. I want to go ahead and just give a disclaimer right now that this series will not be showcasing all of the gameplay. It will not be showcasing all the side quests and exploration because there's a lot of that involved. And as entertaining as that is, I can't really be funny enough to justify making entire episodes where nothing happens except for me doing a couple side missions. So this series is going to be focused entirely on the story. Every video will be another story mission. That means some videos are going to be really long, some are going to be really short, but ultimately it should just kind of clip right through so you can get the story experience and still have a lot of the epicness of the gameplay. Sound good to you guys? Alright, let's go ahead and get started without further ado, The Shadow of Mordor. Story mode! In the land of Mordor, where the shadows lie, it was here, on the slopes of Mount Doom, that the Dark Lord Sauron was defeated by the last alliance of men and elves. It is here that for two and a half thousand years the villagers of Gondor stood watch, guarding against a nameless threat they had all forgotten. And while the strength of Gondor faded, the power of the malice of Sauron grew in darkness. He has returned to Mordor. Shadow and flame have fallen on the black gate. And no mortal man can stand in its path. Oh. You're a... Is a perfect swing for killing chicken. <laughs> Wouldn't want to hurt you. <laughs> Take a lot more than that. <laughs> <laughs> Dear Hyle, the mighty chicken killer. Come on. Come on. Show your father what you have, huh? Well, that escalated rather quickly. Okay. Counter! <laughs> Wow, the graphics are not as great for PC as I would have liked. And I have a fairly high-end graphics card, but I feel like this isn't the best port. It's actually probably a lot better on Xbox One or PS4. There we go. Whack my son. Whack him in the face. Ugh. Ugh. This is basically just a tutorial, as you would expect. Easy, son. You're not a soldier yet. I think I will have your guts, sir. Right trigger and tap X. I will say I love that it's running at 60 feet per second right now. This is great. Oh, I can tackle! Alright, 60 frames per second is a pretty nice deal, I'll admit, but... Oops. Nope, that didn't work. Let's try that again. There we go. Ah, oh, stabby stab in the side. Perfect. 
Now, I'm not sure if you guys were able to see that, um... Whoop, 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 whoop. Grab and throw. Grab and throw what? People? Alright. Oh, there we go. Ah! I wasn't sure if you guys were able to see the entire cutscene that has to do with, um... Sauron arriving in Mordor, kind of, uh... Reminiscent of the uh, first Lord of the Rings series of movies. It's possible that that's copyright, in which case I do apologize. There's not a whole lot that can be done about it. I don't want to get sued, so... Let's just uh, pick you up and throw you off the ground. There we go. And you're already dead. Okay. Yeah, the cutscene graphics looked great. What's wrong with the in-game? These orcs are much stronger than any we've ever seen. They're not orcs, they're orcs. Far worse. There's too many. Go find your mother. Go find your mother. Keep her safe. I'll be right behind you. Go. Yeah, the downside is we know how this ends. Oh, buddy. You're in for a rough day. Am I dead? You are banished from death. Okay, the graphics look a little bit better in this. Still nowhere as near as good as the cutscene. This game is definitely meant to be played on one of the new generation consoles. Still quite beautiful as far as scenes are concerned. Right trigger for stealth. I want to kiss my wife. Hey, yes I do. Heck yes. <laughs> Happy anniversary, my love. Alien. This is beautiful. Where did you find it? I still have a few friends left in Gondor. Did you talk to my father? Yes, I did. And nothing has changed. He's still very stubborn. I say we go anyway. Dear, I will not come willingly. There must be a better life than this. Not now. But soon. I'm just so tired of hiding here, Italian. <laughs> Hide now, or we are both dead. Come on. I thought Deer Hyle was looking for her. Or is this not my wife? We should have left when we had the chance. Uh, that would that would darken my mood about this game a little bit. But let's go ahead and whoops, stealth, is my stealth on by. And stabby stab. Ooh, brutal. So far it plays exactly the same as something like Batman Arkham Asylum, which by the way, one of my favorite games of all time. So I like a familiar play style, it works for me. Where's the last orc? I know there was one more. Oh, there he is. Crouching over there, are you? Looking at the broken cart? Well, you're dead now. Oh, right to the skull! Put the sword down, Ranger. That's not an orc. The Black Heart wants him alive! Ignore it! Take her! Okay, I don't like that guy. First on my kill list, the guy with the mace. Good, I'm a 
See for yourself. Ooh. Now, do you believe me, Ranger? What has happened to me? You are banished from death. Cast adrift between the worlds of light and dark. Curse binds us together within the walls of Arda. If what you say is true, then how do we break this curse? We find the one who cast it on us. The Black Hand of Sauron. I'm not familiar with the Black Hand in the lore, but, uh... You know what? I don't even care. I'm pissed. Gotta kill my wife and my son. I'm not as upset about my son, but I'm definitely upset about my wife. Shadow of Mordor, I'm gonna stalk him until the end of my time. An anvil and a hammer. Okay. This looks familiar. Okay, yes. Press white account. Okay, we're loading screen. Loading screen. All right, I understand that. belongs to Gondor. Father, if you turn my love in, I shall swear I killed Lord Asgon when he attacked me. We shall both sacrifice our lives to Gondor. What was that? Is there going to be is there going to be stuff in between every loading screen? Ooh, that's kind of a cool touch. I like it. Reforge. All right, done deal. Ooh! Forge towers, memories, missions, collectibles, and Mirian, which is M. I believe that's the equivalent of XP in this game. So this is the map of Mordor. Very nice. Alright, well, such begins the game. I guess I'll just run forward real quick and we'll start it up and then uh, I'll cut to the next story mission. Uh-oh. Sir, we missed one of you at Narcos, eh? An easy mistake to fix. Why is the graphics so much worse for this? Ooh. That's a fake bow. Okay. Left trigger to enter range. Right to charge the shot. And... Yep. And... Yep. You will suffer and... what you've done. Yep. Ah! Wraith stun, huh? Okay. Ooh. And we'll just execute you the old-fashioned way. Just like Batman Arkham Asylum. I love it. I can just cut his throat open. It's disgusting. What the heck? Oh! That's new. Go back to him. Okay. Yes, sir. Right away, Mr. Elf Wraith. Okay, if he's down, I can grab him. Hold right button and A to interrogate. Ooh. Gain intel. What do you know of the Black Hand of Sauron? He is a fiend. Made of thin air. What more? A slave I had swears he fought him. I sold him for a keg of grog to give the slaver. 
These are the captains of Sauron's army. They appear as shadows because you do not yet know their identity. Press A. By interrogating enemies, I can uncover valuable information about the captains. Including Gimub the Slaver. Press A to continue. He's a veteran captain with a power rating of three. Uh, do I know anything else? No, but I know where he is and that's where the main mission is. Okay. Okay. We've marked him as our target. That is where we have to go. If one can trust an orc, trust has nothing to do with it. His thoughts cannot lie. Well, 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 everybody. I emerge a wraith. And now we know exactly where to go for the next mission. So basically every gold icon is gonna be a video. Everything else I will do off camera, but if it's particularly notable, I'll show it off at some point. Two available missions, the Slaver and the Spirit of Mordor. I'm sure I'm gonna have to do both, so I'll probably do the Slaver first. All right, guys, well, thank you for watching. This has been Provis with the Shadow of Mordor. I'm gonna try to improve these graphics a little bit, see what I can coax out of my... Uh, out of my graphics Nothing card. In the meantime, sense. stay tuned for the rest of the story.